Real President Day here, Amber from the Vaults, here back with some more Tropico 6. And I gotta be honest, I'm pretty terrible at this. Uh, so it turns out once you complete a mission, the mission keeps going, it doesn't just end. Uh, you know, how was I supposed to know? Usually in games, missions end. I, I didn't think they would continue going. <laughs> Uh, we have to learn to uh, be responsible for our actions, and that is something this game just taught me. So, we're going to go ahead and continue on in the game here, and I'm going to admit to being terrified and not knowing what I'm doing, but that's okay. This is called the learning curve. We're going to go ahead and get back into it, and I'll see you guys back in just a sec. Okay, you have at least gotten some planks. Or some logs, excuse me. Alright. Increases log consumption efficiency however is increased and I don't want to change my log my logging huh governor the people have a request but for safety reasons it is a secret produce corn yeah I can do that okay so we'll need a new plantation but this one has to have corn what I could do is just change one of my old plantations into corn but I feel like that would be too easy instead we're gonna build a new one might as well we're actually doing really good on money so far this should automatically be corn there we go okay and this should be only local consumption I can't do that though so okay there we go let's go ahead and uh, produce some corn I mean, this is a pretty good place, actually, to build up here. I don't think anybody else really wants their corn, so... That kind of works out a little bit. Okay. Let's do this, so we can just get more done. And then we're also going to need... something just happened, I have no idea what. Um, but we're gonna need more homes, because I can't have you not living anywhere. That doesn't make any sense. You're gonna need homes. So... One more bunkhouse. Okay, I think we're doing alright so far. Let's see, what else do we have, potentially? I mean, we could build another logging camp, as much as I do not appreciate logging. Which I don't, necessarily. Although I will say, before anybody jumps on too much, uh, I, I did take forestry in, in school. I um, actually almost got my minor in forestry, decided not to, because foresters are... Well, they're evil. <sighs> Not really, I'm kidding. Uh, but <laughs> the foresters and wildlife people don't uh, get along as a joke. I think, at least I think it's a joke. I hope they don't actually hate us. Um, but it's actually kind of good to cut down trees. It just depends on how you're doing it. So don't worry. It's okay. You can cut down some trees. Just don't cut them all down. Why do you have a monthly income of zero? Almanac. I have no one unemployed. But I do have people who are homeless. I don't like that. I have no way to build you houses, though. Let's see. Low quality. But don't you need... You still need money. Okay. The problem is it said that they were broke so my concern is that it isn't that there wasn't a place to live my concern is that they couldn't afford the places there are to live but I don't know I'm not sure so we will see why aren't more planks being exported I'm starting to get worried almanac hmm that didn't seem to help much huh I mean... Fine. I think we will look into that. 
I think maybe it'd be a good idea. I refuse to have the penal colony, though. I don't want anyone homeless. I, I don't believe in, uh... I actually don't like the word homeless. I prefer the word, um, unhoused. But I don't want anyone unhoused. So we're gonna go ahead and give everybody free housing. The palm tree population of the island is much reduced. And I, for one, am sleeping better because of it. And as a bonus, we made some plonks. Not sure what they're for, but they're nice and plonky. What would you like as your bra uh, reward? Ooh, 24 months, because I want to make corn for these people. I feel like the corn is very important. I'm realizing that I'm getting... Okay. I, I'm realizing what's going on here, Amber. You have begun to care too much about a stupid game. <laughs> this is my problem with life. So people always tell me that my heart is too big and uh, I, I can't make, you know, like basic decisions uh, <laughs> that would be negative. Uh, that's, you'll see in games, I tend to try to always be the good guy. And I'm experiencing that right now. I refuse to give up yet, because I don't want them to... Uh, I, I just don't want them to be... Uh, not having their corn. <laughs> That's so silly, isn't it? Excuse Whoa. me, Oxford. I need a teensy tiny favor. Or, oh, as this telegram I received this morning says, that overambitious, egotistical bug, I think that's you, should do as we instruct without making a blunder. You won't make a blunder, will you? Our last blunderer's ears are nailed, still nailed to the pillory. Build a dungeon? I don't want to build a dungeon. I do not believe in a dungeon. Um... Can I place your dungeon way out in hell and underfund it? Like, quite literally? Because I don't want to see your dungeon. There. There's your dungeon. <laughs> I'm not putting it on my main area. I, I, not happening. My people don't deserve to be in a dungeon. My god. I must say, I'm glad to be still working with you. Finding good help is so Ugh. You disgust me. Just disgust me. Um. Decreases the efficiency by 30% and generates 25 for each inmate per month? Absolutely not. Um, unless they're being paid that $25, abso-fucking-lutely not. You... Um, mm, mm, the thoughts that I have that I should keep to myself. <laughs> I just, I don't think we should be using a fucking penal colony to put people in. Also, why would people be being put in detention right now? I have fantastic worker, or fantastic people around here. By the way, I'm going to completely, like, destroy everything. Viva la revolución! Together, Governor Ju, I, and the people will turn everything around. We need more revolutionary immigrants. Okay. Here we go. Let's figure out how to visit this theater. Oh, we see these days. Okay. Um So how do I do this? I'm not sure how I visit the theater yet, though. Still haven't figured this one out. Okay. Um, let's pause. Let me figure this out. I do too much walking. And then maybe. Onwards to destiny. Oh, wait, does that mean I'm going to go there now? Whew. What a day. No, because she's just randomly in the woods. More, Governor, more. Always more. Hop to it. 
the crown to my... Uh, sure, I guess. Governor, the people have a request. Before sick. Yes, I can do that. Um... I'm concerned. I don't... <laughs> I don't know if that means I'm going there or not. I thought maybe it did. And now I'm very much questioning myself. Okay. I I'm sorry. Let me figure this out. I am so sorry, guys. Give me just a second. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... We'll start a new trade route if we need to. I don't know if our trade route is still open or not. Um, it is. Okay, Viva so we'll just do that. Together. Again, give me ten revolutionary immigrants. I don't know how to attend this, and I feel really stupid not knowing what to do uh, when I get there. So I think what I'll do is, like I said, just figure it out in a second here. So give me just one second. I'm so sorry. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gents, it was not as hard as I I'm pretty sure you guys noticed like a thousand times how I was supposed to do it, and I just missed it. All you gotta do is click on El Presidente, <laughs> nice click visit building, and then you have Onwards to select to the destiny. building. I did not realize you had to select the building like a complete moron. I kept trying to click down in the bottom there. You can see like where the button is that, that puts that in and out. I thought I kept trying to figure out how to click that button because I was like, I can't click it. I, I'm not on a PC, you know, I don't I don't have any options and I feel like such a dipshit. I should buy myself something nice. Like a second palace. Is she going or not? Okay. No offense to El Presidente, but she is a little bit Governor, the people have a request. But for safety reasons it is a sp Okay, before she gets in there, let's see if we can really quickly build this tavern. Um, doubt it, but we'll try. Just because I got a feeling we're about to be murdered, or someone's gonna attempt it. They're obviously not gonna actually murder us, because we're the president. Thank you. There we go. We're going in. We got some good money, too, right now. All right, let's see what happens. Governor, I am shot. Oh, alas, poor penultimo. As I reached for the peanuts, something went bang, then bang again. Nine more times. <laughs> I had wondered about the construction of this luxury box. It's very open, isn't it? And this special theater designed by the crown, it has a lot of shadowed eaves. I'm just glad that, penul that penultimal dies, not you, great one. Remember, loyal penultimal <laughs> with just a little statue will help him. Penultimo is a national hero. We respect those who get shot for the cause. Some of us hope to get shot ourselves one day. Don't think that's how it should work, Sophia. When he awakens, would you give him this gift from the people? It is just a coconut, a heavy one, and also a symbol of our struggle. <laughs> Belt defenses, my governor. Like the hard shell of this coconut, we must prepare for independence. Oh, yes. Yes, we must. I love independence. I love that speak. I don't love that speak, though, I will say. When you're talking about becoming independent of me, then I don't enjoy it. But I am a good person. So you should like me. Fabulous. Looks like it was built for that. Okay. So I think the fact that we already have one guard tower counts. Um, gonna guess. Not sure, we are though. prepared for invasion, my governor. And here they come. I hope they are slow, so we can snipe them from afar. Okay, our guard towers work, governor. We can defend ourselves. Hurrah! I have waited for this struggle all my life. No, wo no longer will we take instructions from others. We will have freedom to make our own bad decisions and to squabble among ourselves. Oh, governor, you look so pretty today. Oh, sorry, I have been bleeding a little since I was shot, and my head feels very light. 
But you are right. Work comes first. You must please your people to secure their support for when you can proclaim independence. And this is necessary before the crown has you killed. Which method will you use to shower your people with happiness? Um, liberty. It will help the people fight for happiness. Yes, because we're almost to liberty. Okay, so what do I need to do now to give my people more liberty? How do I make them think they have more liberty even if they don't? Liberty! Increases liberty nearby. Aha! Okay. So actually, what am I doing? Go back. And I need to build more of those. What the heck? Actually, one more thing. Uh, provides faith to citizens, no wealth requirements, sells edible goods, uh, sells... Okay. Just wanted to check and see how we were doing. Okay. Newspaper. Right now, that newspaper is affecting them. But I have other areas. We also have people over here. And they need their own newspaper. And it needs to be built quickly. And we want it to be the independent. And then we'll pause this real quick. Do I have any detainees in here? No. Good. I apologize. You need homes. I am so sorry that I did not build you homes. I'm going to build you little country houses. Because they're so much cuter. I love those. Alright, and I think there's only a couple of you anyway. So, homes. Country house. I believe that allows two families to live in them. And I think I have four guards. Correct? Yes. Okay. So let's do that quickly. Nice. Okay. Perfect. So you guys should all have homes now. Still don't understand what this means when it says it's out of stock, but either way, let's keep going. All right, so we want to build that newspaper. Y'all deserve one too, even if you are my pirates. I think of all the people in the world, pirates deserve papers. Why wouldn't a pirate want to read a newspaper? Think about it. it sounds fabulous. All right. And this newspaper will also be called The Independent. I want all my newspapers to have all the money in the world. I'm pro newspaper. And then I also want you to have edicts. Let's make edicts. Touch food. Lights, felt citizens who are all skin and bones. By doubling food rations, you can make everyone happy. Well, except for the wealthy tycoons whose market economics thrive on scarcity. But everyone else will be mildly pleased at your generous gesture. Besides, it will be years before the detrimental health effects of chronic obesity will get noticed. Right? Am I right? I'm right. You're right. Okay. Let's see. Mandatory siesta. Free housing. Why should proud tropicans live in shacks when there are far more comfortable dwellings sitting empty? If our citizens truly are equal, they should be allowed to live rent-free in any building they choose. And the really equal ones should get the mansions. Think of how happy the people would be, and think how unhappy your accountant would be. It is a win-win. Gonna get the people on my side, I so... I am always looking for ways to make our export business more efficient, and... The biggest problem is that big boats are so slow. Well, we can squeeze a few knots out of every vessel if we wax the hull to reduce drag and switch from diesel engines to wither shins. It will cost a little more in maintenance, but more speed means quicker export money. What the hell's a wither shin? Uh, child allowances. Children are not accounted for when determining the economic wealth of a family. The edict costs three dollars per child per month. Hmm. 
So I don't really... Let's do this I... one. Uh, research employee of the month. Okay. We need to increase people's liberty still. Um, there's got to be other ways to do that, right? I thought maybe... Let's see, that increases their knowledge. Hmm. This is all Cold War. I'm not 100% sure. I have to build them some... Some nice stuff. Maybe... I don't know. Do they even want parks? I don't know. Huh. I know there's got to be a way to do it. Have an average liberty happiness. Um, let's real quick look at our open trade here. Let's see. We've got the gold nut still going out. Uh, and we've still got the fish. Okay, so the crown is still working with the fish. We need freedom for the people. How do I do that? <laughs> How do I do that? Liberty. It's yellow, so... It's affected by certain buildings, such as those newspapers. Um, citizens are affected by a local liberty while resting at home and at their workplace. So actually, maybe that edict for mandatory siesta. Work is hard. And nobody appreciates that more than you, Presidente. You've never had to do a day of hard labor in your life, and you aren't about to start now. As a show of goodwill to the citizens of Tropico, a mandatory two-hour siesta is to be declared after lunch. It is not a great recipe for productivity, but it sure breaks up those long afternoons slaving away. With this edict, you snooze, but you do not lose. I think that will help. Did that make people happier? Let's find out. Might take some time. Hmm. Okay. Okay. And we're still waiting. no one here? There's no one here. Darn it. Okay. Um. Let's go forward in time. I'm just getting a little nervous now. Because now we're like going to go into a... I might not have enough. I ask myself, Governor, do the of course I can build the tavern. But I'm concerned that we might not have enough citizens at this point. I I'm getting a little worried. Get a little worried. That would be a great place to put a tavern. I definitely don't have one. But pirates need taverns. Okay, I needed to get more, some, get some more immigrants. Okay. I guess you go and just do whatever you want, basically. <laughs> I'm not really in the business of telling my pirates what to do. Okay. How are we doing on those fish? You know what? I should really open another fisherman's wharf. I almost said wart. That would be stupid. Fisherman's wharf. There we go. I should really open a second one. Because we could be exporting so many more fish right now than we are. Hmm. Okay. It's just not gonna let me go through there at all, is it? 
Huh. Because the terrain's uneven. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Huh. I... F I don't know if it needs to be... Does it matter if it's... connected by a road or not? Also, what if I just... started doing this? Maybe I'd eventually make it connect. There we go! Beautiful. Okay, so we got another fisherman's wharf. I think that's a good idea. And then, um, okay. Man, this seems like it takes <laughs> more time than I would ever think it would. Okay. So all we have over here is the penal colony. So maybe it would... Oh, shit. Pirates are attacking Tropico. Okay. I gotta get over there do something about that and I will in just a second I swear okay where are the pirates attacking Tropico how do I find the pirates aha How do I, like, call the military or whatever? Uh... Okay, so they are engaging attackers. Okay! Are they, though? Because my lumber mill is currently being attacked. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching me play Tropico 6. If you like this, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and do all those YouTube things. That helps me know which videos you guys would like to see more of. If you want to see more of Tropico 6, let me know. I know typically we don't play a lot of casual games here on the channel, but I do like throwing one in every once in a while. Give us a break from all of the shooters and the bang bangs. So go ahead and let me know if you want to see more of Tropico 6. I am having a blast, but I want to make sure you're having fun too. We're going to go ahead and get out of here, but real quick, just want to say thank you so much to all of the patrons who make this channel possible possible if you would like to support it there is information in the description also a big p that should be a popping up on your screen if it has not already also i want to say thank you to the publisher for giving me a copy of this game so i could play it for you guys there's a few things on your screen hopefully by now there should be that p for patreon there should also be a picture of my big dumb head though if you click that though subscribe to the channel you can go ahead and click on that bell icon if you want to be notified every time i post a new video and there also should be a random playlist of videos there or a video i don't know what i put there i do that all in post so there's something on there. Click it if you want to watch more of my stuff. Or if you don't, you can click away. That's how this works. I'm surprised you made it through the exit. Or the extra. Outro? Outro! I can make a new one, but I won't because I'm human. Let's go ahead and get out of here and I will see you guys in the next one.